Hey guys, the Atari 8-Bit Game Hunter. This is going to be my gaming moment back in time video for this week, December 17th. And today I picked something a little bit different. Um, something Super Nintendo related, so Nintendo people will enjoy this one, I'm sure. When we're talking about video games, specifically like Nintendo, they always seem to come up with something unusual. Not something you would see every day, not something you would think about. And this title by various systems would definitely be um, on that list. Captain Novelin. Now, this is one of five games that various systems released in the early 90s, from 92 to 95. And their whole idea was the whole medical aspect of it. Between being a diabetic, which they did a couple of games on that, um, being asthmatic, they did a game on that, and also doing games on um, being a surgeon. And anybody who's played the DS series of games will know that they've done surgery type video games for the DS as a handheld using the stylus and everything. So when you're looking at medical type video games, specifically with the uh, Nintendo series, um, this would definitely be one of the few games you would have to think about as the innovator behind it and building up as time goes on to what we have today. Now, I'm a sucker for these type of games because A, I'm an EMT, so in that respect I like things medical. But at the same time, I like unusual. Things you're not going to see every day. Things that's going to make you sit there and go, hmm, what the heck were they thinking at that time? This is a game that want. I, I have a feeling the idea behind this whole premise of medical games back in the early 90s was a mix between getting the word out about diabetes, by, about asthma, but as, as much as that as doing it in a way that kids will actually be interested in it. Like this one is based on a superhero who has to go through the game and take care of the blood sugar throughout the day with insulin or whatever. The second one that came out, which I don't recall the name off the top of my head, I should have wrote it down before I made this video, is a game about two, two elephants who go through the jungle trying to get peanuts and everything else, rescue their peanuts back, but at the same time watching what they're eating and keeping short, making sure that blood sugar stays in an acceptable range. If it gets too high, they have to pick things up along the way that's going to lower their blood sugar. And likewise, if it's too low, they have to find things that they can pick up to bring up their blood sugar. Interesting game, interesting philosophy behind the game. Um, this one, I, this uh, Novelin game I picked up on eBay it was about $40. The various systems games all, all along are usually more expensive. It's definitely one of the more unique titles, group, group of titles, I'll say. Um, I'm going to throw a little bit of gameplay in this um, right about here, so I want you guys to get a look at this game and see a little bit of what this game's about.
All right, well, there you have it. That's um, Captain Overland for the Super Nintendo. This week's gaming moment back in time. I want you guys to um, let me know what you think. Um, your feedback on these games is, would greatly be appreciated because not just me just showing off a game that I enjoyed or something that was unique. I like to hear what you guys have to say because this is a gaming community and just the idea of bringing these games out, out of the woodwork, either as a hidden gem, something totally unique and odd, or something that we didn't know about before, but now that we look back as, as a retrospect, now we'll be like, you know what, that was something more than what we originally initially thought it was. And that's what these videos are designed to do. Bring um, a whole n another point of view to these games, and looking back at them, seeing a different point of view about the games. So with that said, I appreciate you guys checking out this video like always. Um, thumbs up, thumbs down, leave a comment. Um, start start a debate or a conversation about these games because that's what they're here for. And um, I'll see you guys later in the week.